Welcome back. This is Curtis with Sky Realty. And today I uh, had an opportunity. I saw my broken link checker uh, deliver me a broken link, and I thought this would be a good opportunity to demonstrate one of my favorite plugins and one of the easy pitfalls that a perfectly good working plugin can deliver to you. So, uh, what I want to demonstrate is um, the broken link checker, why it's important, and uh, how to use it effectively. So if you have a website that links to various resources within um, your market area, for example, school websites or maybe flooring companies, you might have some flooring companies and you'll link to their website. Well, one thing you don't want to do is you don't want to link to uh, websites that are down. It creates broken links in your website. The consumer certainly doesn't like finding broken links. It uh, devalues the credibility of your website and the search engines don't have much appreciation for it either. It means that the website's not being maintained properly. So keeping a good uh, clean house of links is important. Making sure they go to the right places and making sure they're not broken. So what I want to do, what I want to demonstrate today is a very simple plugin. And if you look on my dashboard here, you'll see it says found one broken link. 1,795 URLs in the work queue. So every day, this thing, this link checker reads through the whole website looking for broken links. Does the work for me. How do I get it? I simply go to plugins and um, add new and simply type in broken link checker. And you'll find this plugin will be right at the very top. And as you can see, I've already installed it. Now, once it's installed and you're, you're getting these messages on your dashboard that say that you have a broken link, you need to address those links. And it's very quick and it's very easy. Right here is a simple link to the page that manages your broken links. And the reason and what, prompt, or what prompted me today to demonstrate this was I saw this broken link to servicemagic.com. And if you see related, L&M Plumbing. Now, um, I didn't feel like that this was a broken link. My gut was kind of telling me that it wasn't, so I wanted to check it out right away. You'll see the status here, and quite often you'll see unknown error, uh, maybe internal error, or 500 internal server error, or you might even find a 404 page unknown. That's not always the case. The reason that is, is maybe this link checker was running while their site went down for an hour. And therefore, it would deliver me a report that that website's broken. Now, websites go up and down. They have problems. They're, they run into glitches where they're running slow. And therefore, it'll look like the link is broken. So it's very important to understand that the link checker, as well as it does work, and I've been very happy with this plugin, um, just by its very nature, it's checking links that aren't always working. So um, this is the link text. This is where what's actually linked to this is the word that's linked to this link here. And this is where I can find it. So if I ever wanted to go look at it on the page, I just simply click that and that'll take me to um, where that link is, is housed, Austin Area Plumbers. So knowing that this plumbing company is still in business or I feel like they are, I wanna double check the link. And so all this is telling me I have an error or it could say 404 page not found, I wanna click on the link itself. And it, I see that I'm at Home Advisor, and also see that I'm at L&M Plumbing and Home Remodeling. I see that there's um, four and a half stars in their phone number. It looks like they're still around. It looks like the link is actually still working. So I'm going to dismiss it, and I'm going to just simply say link not broken. Now, one of the important things to also know is that sometimes a link may change. I may find them on a different place. I could edit the URL right here. Change the URL, correct it, hit update, and it'll actually update it on the page where the link has been created. So um, I just wanted to point out that this is a very common error. It's, it's very easily remedied just by simply checking before you uh, label it as broken and unlink it. I'm going to label it as not broken. It takes it from the queue. That is the broken link checker explained very simply. Please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel. 
youtube.com forward slash user forward slash sky realty have a great day